While we were busy rejecting God, hating God, cursing at God, following our own path, he was busy reconciling us back to himself through his son. So you're busy in rebellion, he's busy reconciling you back to himself. And Paul asks a simple question here. If while we were enemies, Christ died for us, how much better will he treat us now that we're his sons and daughters? Think about that. If he died for us while we're his enemies, now we're his friends, how much more will he love us, care for us, and give us what we need according to his will? If God helps his enemies, Paul is saying, of course God's gonna help you. You've been reconciled back to God. The work has been done. You have peace with God. You've been reconnected. There's no more war with God. There's no more wrath. We are eternally at peace with God through Christ. Now that we're sons and daughters, God's gonna treat you well. If you just logically think about, if God did all this for me while I was his enemy, while I hated him, have you thought about this? How much more now?